Yes, we are back. And uh, we're playing Out There, Omega Edition. You play as that guy from that episode of Scooby-Doo, right? Spooky Kook, right? Isn't that him? With the green, like, uh... He's like the astronaut with the green skull in his mask. That's me. Spooky Kook. Uh, new game. I'll let you watch the intro with no cursor. I'm an astronaut aboard the Nomad. Passenger on a line that connects Earth to Ganymede. A moon of Jupiter. Going to Ganymede, guys. Until something happened. Wake up. When I awoke from cryonics, cryonics. I wasn't in orbit around Ganymede. In fact, I wasn't even in the solar system anymore. Where is everybody else? There's a story in this. I'm sure it'll tell me if I ever get there. This game ain't easy. That's right, I used the word ain't. I was... The not word? Out there. I was out there. When you say your title, right? It like, once you say the title of the thing, that's like when you can turn it off. It's like, it's awesome. All right, so, despite everything that you are about to see, I did play the tutorial and do know how to play. I swear. This is it. This is what it gives you. It's like, there's a thing over there. And I'm way the fuck over here. And it's like, good luck, everybody. You can zoom out if you have a telescope. If you don't have a telescope, it says right here. If you don't have that, it breaks. You lose it. It's not in your ship. Whatever. You can't do this. This is all you see. You're just like been here all right so let's go over some things this is like your local screen this is the stuff that's near you um, we were just here we're not gonna go there and lose fuel for no reason it's your ship screen do a lot of stuff on this screen pull your resources in upgrade your ship build stuff uh, no 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 and then there's this star map, right? Choose where you're gonna go. You hit travel. There's a uh, video that plays, but I think that was just there for mobile. This is, was a mobile game, so anyone who's played the mobile game, you guys, are super experts and shit. Um, cool. I never played this game. Space station fit for an average human being. Okay. The star is fluctuating spasmodically. Inside, a curious device is installed pointing at the raging sun. My arrival ruins. Oh, God. Maybe it can help me? Oh. That's what happened. I have a feeling that this guy is like important somehow. And he doesn't know yet. Did I destroy the sun? Can I? No. Eh, not a sun, a star. No. Uh, fuck you. Alright, fuel. That's what we want. Fuel. Go over here. Lose. Holy shit! We lost almost half our health. Fuck. You get to choose if you want to be a little bitch. Right, that's, that's what that 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 color means. You be a little bitch. That's that's normal. That's normal. And this is just dumb. So you you're either just normal, dumb, or you're being a little bitch. We're gonna go with with normal at seven. Because when you do this, this shit breaks almost every time. That's a that's a good haul. Okay. Stop double clicking. What the fuck? Um. In the beginning. Which I've never gotten past, so in the beginning I suggest always using these uh, Using your resources because holding on to it just means you run out of space for stuff Like if you need fuel use your fuel just use it because sometimes you'll do an event and stuff. Just bad stuff happens to you constantly. Really? Black hole? 
I'm not going that way. All right. It's hard to build clockwork quality equipment with nothing but random drifting salvage. I need to fix it. Oh, great. There. No telescope. That's it. No scroll. No zoom. This is it. Um, could play like this, I guess. But it's still taking a I'm about to just dismantle it. We're gonna go. No telescope. Maybe that's like... Advanced play. Disable your telescope immediately. You don't need it anyway. Uh, uh, you fucking nerds. Uh, we need telescope, right? Um, I have no idea. I don't know anything about the community of players that played this game. I'm just... That's how most elitists act, right? They just... They mad at the decisions. Not the decisions that they're making, because they're making the right ones. They're mad at your decisions instead. Which is fucking a batshit crazy. Like, who fucking cares how someone else is playing their single player game? That shit don't affect you. Uh, let's get the fuck out of here. That's... <laughs> telescope required. I didn't know you needed a telescope to see what the planet even was. <laughs> oh, shit. A bubble as big as an asteroid is floating, dotted with shiny blinking spots. Um, Wait and see. It's a pocket of antimatter. Oh. Uh, what the fuck? Ooh, garden planet. This is this is the this is the coolest thing I've done in the game. Is found planets with people on them. Well, with aliens on them. Actually, that's not true. I lied. I found another ship once, and that was awesome. It was just like a free ship. All right. I'm gonna try and talk to some homies. Okay, that's um, it's a pretty cool guy. He plays some underground, and runs away. So he gave me, gives me the Omega. Probably good because it's the Omega edition. We're going to drill into his planet because we're friends now, right? So we we do that type of stuff. Whoa, a lot of carbon, a lot of oxygen, and this is. Hopper. Pay attention in school, kids. Or you'll have to learn these things just because you're playing a game about them. Alright, finish. Sooner. Fuck. I can't repair my ship. I don't have any iron. My hull is taking a beating. This doesn't take any on the way out. Um, kind of want some iron, but I don't want to waste any more fuel over here. In this, this. Can I combine it? Oh, shit. You can use that. Wait. Constantly scrambles and reassembles itself. You can use it to repair anything, but sometimes it's used in like future tech technology that you learn from the aliens. Let's just go. Who knows, right? Telescopes required to figure that out. Bombarded by cosmic rays, melted some of my equipment, might also, might also have given me cancer. Oh my god, super depressing. That's super depressing. Uh, I can't repair it because I don't have any iron. I need that. I need that to do everything. Can I land on a planet without it? No. No, I fucking can't. <laughs> I need to repair it with the Omega. Sucks, but... trying to learn, get farther, and learn, you know? This is the beginning of roguelike. You learn as much as you can, do whatever you need to do to get far, and learn more things. Because you don't want to start having strategies 
early on that you find out none of that shit matters later. Then you're just upset. Okay, what is, what is this? Alright. Find a structure holding several statues. One of them is a broken space folder. Study it. It's a geoscanner. Okay, so we found a geoscanner technology. We need gold. Oh shit, that's pretty sick. Uh, we got copper, we don't have any gold. Maybe if we drill on the planet. Nope. This is this sucks. Cause I want this. All right, know what to do? Make that overflow, right? Take that. <sighs> We're leaving you behind. Is there anything I can get rid of? Yeah, I can. Hey, here it is. Leave you behind. Finish, and we're gonna use stuff. We're gonna use stuff, and we're gonna drill again, because that was a crazy return. What is that? Hafnium? Is that real? Doesn't sound real. <laughs> Somewhere, a chemistry major is like, You fucking assholes! Fucking Hafnium! You don't know Hafnium? No, fuck you! <laughs> All right, we're drilling again. Take some half <laughs> Uh We're going to leave that. You don't need that much, usually, in a uh, recipe. Let's call them a recipe, sure. All right, see, it's like one. You need one, 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 one. Everything. Not a lot. Mm. It's pretty good, actually. Fortunately, we're doing pretty well, so we're probably going to die horribly. Alright, I always click on the wrong buttons. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't want to chill in this place anymore. I want to jump to somewhere close. That's cool. Let's jump. Jump to here, then we can jump super far. <sighs> really? Broke my drill? No big deal. Garden planting, let's go. Land. Yes. Oxygen full. Go talk to somebody. Hey, it's my uh, fire buddies. Yeah, man, I mean, whatever you say. Alright, I said the wrong thing. Oh, he was like, are you the bringer of death? And I'm like, of course, bro. You didn't know? Shit. That sucks. We're gonna drill. Look at gold, right? That's pretty sick. Could fill that up. Uh, we don't need any more oxygen. Cobalt. That's real. Oh, that's real. I think these are all real. Hafnium. I'm gonna look up hafnium. That sounds scary. Take off. Uh. Let's go here. Shit. Alright, so this dude knew Mandarin. Alright, I wonder if the space folder isn't just asking the stars permission to approach. Dude is losing his shit. Fast. Good. We need... Yes, I know, we need fuel. That's... and here's part of the... Ah, oh, God. That's what I always do to myself. Finish. That's really bad. That's really bad. I can't really repair the hull. This isn't gonna cut it. Shit. Gotta get out of here. Let's go there. Flying at top speed through a massive cosmic web. A spider web. Oh god, that's so, so fucking creepy. I did my best to fly between the giant strands and to dodge the huge spiders floating within it. That... Uh, 
could have been much worse. Yeah. Fucking... Yeah, dude. Um, gonna die. Gonna die, because I cannot repair the hull. There we go. We're good. We're good. I mean, what am I gonna do? Yeah. I need iron. Need iron. Need iron. And hafnium. And something that's a W. Tungsten. Tungsten's real as fuck. Alright. Need this. Damn, that is not. Hmm. Hmm. So it's very much like resource management, math, uh, storytelling, decision making, learning a language. It's fucking, this game is nuts. I can't believe this was a mobile game. Uh, I found out about this game. Well, one, it was on Steam. It was like right there, like, blam, get this out there, Omega. This, and I'm like, nah, I don't want to get that. And then I, uh, I'm gonna take off one time. Am I dead? No. All right, cool. Not dead. Gonna die though. And then it was like, um, one of those post mortem article jammies. At least I think that's what they're called, right? Developer talks about how fucking rough developing, being like an indie dev was, and all this shit, and I, it was like the first thing I saw when I woke up, right? And like, instantly on Twitter, I'm like, bam, this article just sold a copy. That's real, real thing. Fucking look it up. I said it. I bought it. Here I am playing it, and it's fucking great. This game is great. Oh, I'm dead. Here we go. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. We're dead. We died. That's why I said use your stuff, because it's like sometimes you run into problems like that. And, uh... I mean, I don't have any stuff to use right now, so I'm dead. I can do this, but it's gonna be like, should we risk it? Yeah, okay. And it says, like, should I risk it? And it never lets me do anything else after. What the fuck? Hmm. So like most roguelike type thing, roguelike likes, whatever the fuck people want to call them. Uh, you know, your mileage may vary. You might get real far first time. You might get nowhere. Uh, I didn't. I don't feel like I made it anywhere this time. I've gotten to a point where I've gotten like another ship, and it was huge. I got like a new quest. I was like. Oh my god, and I wasn't even anywhere near any objectives on the other side. So, that's it. That's the end of my journey. Is this the screen? Right? It's their score screen, but this screen scares the shit out of me. Right? What the hell? Right? Different spaceships. Stars destroyed, so we become... Right? We become fucking Darth Vader. Start blowing up fucking stars. We get to terraform planets. I don't have any of that shit. Um, humans save? Like, shit gets real? Shit gets real as fuck? So, if you have any interest in story, adventure, rogue, like a light, like a likes, uh, space game things, I suggest getting this. If you hate resource management because part of your brain that does math was burned out by radiation as a child like mine was um, it's gonna be a little hard it's a little hard for me but I like it anyway uh, as always thank you for watching this is out there Omega edition you can get on Steam it's nine dollars you can get it for nine bucks um, it's on sale one dollar off so you can get it for ten bucks too it's also, I think it's also on Android and iOS. Hmm. So, I mean, go look for it. You'll find it. You can buy it on whatever you want. Play it, because that's the fucking point, alright? That's the idea. Buy the game, enjoy it. Have fun playing a video game, because that's so goddamn hard for everyone to do lately. Right? 
most, uh, I don't really want to get into it, but like most YouTube channels about gaming is either about comedy, which is good, that's fun, or about just shitting all over other games, which is weird that people want to watch that. Um, I think that that's crazy. That negativity is crazy. It's like everyone knows that that, that that weird, obscure, early access title, which there are a billion of, was fucking bad. But I, you think I want to make a YouTube channel about that shit? Hell no, I don't want to do that. I'd rather just play shit that's fun, have fun, and tell other people to fucking have fucking fun. Alright? So yeah, there's that's it. Slash end rant or whatever. Right? Uh... Yeah, that's it. I'm Jeff. Snow Gimmick Gaming. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Uh, please have fun playing video games. Be good to each other. Have a good fucking time. Shit. Is that so hard? It's really not that hard. Enjoy. Enjoy this shit. Because it's fucking great. Have some fucking fun. And uh, till next time. Peace out.